The final theme is contestant number one, Sujita Bosna. And with a very big round of applause, ladies and gentlemen, let me take a moment to announce the very first name for the social impact leader is Raksha Upridi. Judges who will vote 50% about the Hamid Hanika. So, People's Choice Ma, two legends will be placed who will be able to secure their spots for the top 10. And the deserving legend is Sabun Guru. Congratulations! I like to choose the curiosity of the child because the curiosity leads us to learning. Curiosity leads us to knowing more, leads us to know what's for us in the world. So I never stop learning. That's why I like to choose curiosity of the child. Thank you. Thanks so much, Raksha. You're looking lovely. Hello, Thank you so much. So my question to you is, if you were to create a new Nepal, on another planet, what are the two things you will create first and why? Thank you for your question. I think Nepali is what makes Nepal, so I would create the people first if I had to create Nepal in another planet because it, it is us Nepali that we make Nepal. And the second thing I would want to make would be the food that we are known for. It is so diverse and so rich in culture. I choose food, lovely Nepali food with lovely Nepali people, for sure. Thank you. Thank you so much. Hi, Arya, how are you? Hi, I'm good, how are you? Doing good, thank you. Um, the question for the radio room is very much so, right? Um, you are Musta Sangha, this is what you are going to ask for your question. तब इन त्यों पोजिशन में पुकारू भाइयों जहाँ तब इन देश को लागी के ही नियम करो चेंज करने पर ये बने तब इन क्या चेंज करने उनसे रखी ना पेरी चुटी बंदियों थैंक यू सो मच फॉर द क्वेश्चन इफ आई एम टू रीच टू अ पोजिशन वेर आई कैन मेक एंड चेंज रूल्स एंड लॉस द फर्स्ट थिंग आई वुड डू � I would, I would uh, have the longer uh, imprisonment for them and make uh, Nepal a safer place for our females. I'd like to move ahead with the next uh, contestant we have, Sujita. So my question for you is, um, do you identify as a feminist? Why or why not? Thank you. 
If I had to choose, I definitely identify myself as a feminist because the word feminism does not associate with a gender or a sex, but it actually associates with having wanting equality amongst our population. And so I absolutely do identify with the word feminism because I do want, agree that it's not just a world of men or women, but it's a world of us people, and we must uplift each other to accomplish great things in the world. Thank you. Nervous as well? Don't worry, I'm going to ask you a simple one, okay? So, have you ever traveled solo? Have you ever traveled alone? Uh, yes, sorry. I didn't get a chance to travel solo, but I, I really want to travel solo. Sure. So if you ever do travel solo, what would your ideal solo vacation look like and why? Well, thanks so much for your question, ma'am. I really want to travel solo because I want to explore myself because I believe that traveling makes you who you are and it will let you know that uh, there are so many beautiful places where you can really visit and know yourself better. So thank you. Namaste ma'am. Namaste Sanse Ekdam Sanse se ma'am mazur. Ekdam Sanse se ekdam khushi se as a judge for the last time ma'am. Question for you ma'am. Mazur ma'am. What do you think are the three burning issues happening in Nepal right now that requires immediate attention from the government bodies? Thank you, ma'am. I have a question for you. We have a burning issue. We have a burning issue. आपने देश छोड़े रह, रोजगारी को लगे, जनमत हालों छोड़े रह, विदेश जाने पर ही रहेगा सब। तेरे लिए रह बोलने की सीट है। रह और कोई इश्तियो, खाली युवा पुस्ताले सरकार ना चलाए रह, खाली एवं एक पुस्ताले में तो सरकार चलाए रह कोई को सब। I'm good. You look lovely tonight. Thank you so much. My question is a bit sad. Um, last week, a 22 months old girl child was raped by a 39 years old male. So if you were given an opportunity to make your own law and punish the guilty, what punishment would you choose? Thank you for the question. It might sound harsh, but I would rather choose death penalty for those who are rapists. Because you know how hurtful it is to hurt a girl in such a way that she cannot even recover from that uh, inc uh, incident. It takes a month, years, and sometimes she, al she almost compels her to do the suicide. So it should be death penalty and rape should be Strictly punished. Rape is strictly punished. That's all I can say. Thank you so much. Here's my question for you. Who do you trust more, animals or humans? I trust, actually I trust, honestly I trust animals and humans both. It is very likely for us to trust animals because they have this very natural instinct. But me as a human, I would like to put my trust and faith in human as well. We human are capable of so much more than we give ourselves credit to. We are capable of loving, caring, and trusting each other and spreading love. Thank you so much. Thank you. Um, you know, we always say, I love my country, but you know, but if you, if you have to define your country, what does your country mean to you? How would you define your country? Thank you so much for the question, ma'am. I was born and raised in my country. I have seen culture, variations, people. I love all the things about my country. The people are so good to each other, the food, the cultures we have, the languages. I love everything about my country. Thank you so much. Thank you. Are you feeling good? Great. Is everybody, sorry ma'am, to interrupt you, but is everybody's favorite season monsoon? Or you love Manasi ma'am? Both. <laughs> I like that. Thank you so much for that, Nina. We love you back as well. So, Nina, here's my question to you. Which color do you think defines you? My color is pink, the color that I'm wearing right now. This color represents me because it is soft. It is very subtle, just like how I feel inside. 
the same time, it's very feminine and bold, because this color is a nude color. And standing here on the stage, talking to the audience, to everyone here, I feel naked, <laughs> because I'm exposing my inner self to every one of you. So pink is definitely the color representing Thank you. Definitely, you can bring it through here and you can empower the upcoming generations through you. Best wishes, ladies. So it's time for the final round. A common question that we have already mentioned. Let me tell you what is the common question here. I'm going to say that in Nepali and English and Sabiksha is going to translate it to Nepali so that you're comfortable enough. If you have any question, please feel free to ask us. The question goes out here. If you could be a leader in any sector, which one would you choose and why? I'd like to repeat it. If you could be a leader in any sector, which one would you choose and why? Nepal ma, yedi tapai lai kune chhetra ko leader huni moga pai ma kun chhetra chhano huni cha rakina. Thank you so much for the question. I'm here standing in a beauty pageant as one of the contestants. If I had an opportunity to be a leader in any sector, I would choose to be a leader in a beauty pageant itself. I think beauty pageants hold a lot of power to change the beauty norms and standards that are present in our society. The name itself says beauty pageants. And imagine if on an international stage where there are 100 countries competing for a crown, if there are girls, women from, all, women from all around the world representing each and every girl with no beauty standards, Imagine the impact it can have to change the beauty standards that affect our society so much today. Imagine. Thank you. Thank you for the question. I would like to choose to be a leader for children because children are our future. Children are who makes our future and that is what is going to matter in years to come. They have to be hopeful and as I said in my social impact video itself, if children are not hopeful and they are struggling with mental health, where does, where does our future stand? So they are supposed to be full of dreams, full of hopes, and they have to cherish it. So I would like to advocate for children's mental health and push them forward, make them hopeful, and allow them to chase their dreams, like I could. Thank you. Thank you. चीज को लीडर बनना चाहे बने कुने क्षेत्र को लीडर बनना चाहे बने मर राजनीति छानते मर प्रधानमंत्री बनते अली मेरे देश में मौत उस तय युवा हरु सदै विदेश जाने में तो सोचने उनसा कि न कि हमरे देश में रोजगारी का अवसर नहीं चाहिए ना हमरे देश में अस्तित्वता सा सरकार को मस्तित्वता ले मन सहानचु समय समय म प्रधान मंत्री बदली रखने उनसे मंत्री हरु बदली रखने सामी था बहुत है ना मंत्री हरु कि वो नाम है ना नामी कौशल याद करना सबसे समय समय में मंत्री हरु बदली रखने उनसे बने मौ मेरे देश विकास रबा विकास भाई को येरना चाहन चु मौ मेरे देश विकास भाई को होना चाहिए येरना चाहन चु रबा मेरे युवा हरु हमरे य Coming from a place of insecurity and having gone through an eating disorder, I know how it feels to hit the rock bottom. It is lonely, it is sad, it is silent. So I would like to be a leader of people's hearts. I would like to be a queen that would touch each and every heart that feels lonely at this very moment that feels like they're not valuable enough, not powerful enough, like their voices are silent. And I want to show to the universe what a passionate queen's heart is made of. Thank you. If I were to be a leader in any sector, I would choose technology, 
We live in a world where technology drives everything that we do. What is technology? It is innovation, it is cure. We live in a time where we've been facing COVID-19, a worldwide virus, and because of technology, we were able to find a solution. So if I were to be a leader in any industry, it would be technology because one, our nation needs, our entire world, universe, needs innovation, we need cure, and we need the future to understand and communicate with each other about what is going on in our world. And so through technology, we're able to accomplish all of these things. So I would choose to be a leader in technology. Thank you.